Senpai! Hi, my name is Ren. Did my voice just crack? Oh no. Hi, my name is Vitamin D Stain and welcome back to some cursed. <laughs> Oh god, what a rough start. No coming back from that one. Well, yes, it's not King Koi, once again. I haven't felt like playing King Koi. I have been on a very long streak with King Koi. And Cavistella deserves some love, especially because as of lately I've been wanting to play more. But anyways, let's get straight into it. Today is the day off from work. So Hiuchi Danisan and I decided to meet up at the mall to begin investigating the customer from the other day. Hey, you know, I just realized something after seeing your outfit. We're on winter break. <laughs> True. For some reason, I guess I assumed you'd want to put off this, put all this off until after the holidays. You're working on Christmas? You aren't doing anything with your friends? <laughs> Damn, that's tough. Well, good thing this is your route. Ah, not too surprising then. Yeah, I don't have any plans either, so I figured I might as well. Yeah. I gaze wistfully at the decorative Christmas lights hanging around the mall. I had considered asking her out on a date. But it doesn't look like the luck is on my side this year either. Anyway, I digress. We got more pressing concerns at the moment. So, you said you know the girl? Richidani's son turns around to point at a nearby store. This is a boutique gift shop that she often frequents. That's. Oh! Before Richidani's son could point the girl out, I spot her. There she is. A customer from the other day. So she works here. Didn't take us long to find her, did it? Come to think of it, this is where you and I found out about Yuna's dad, too. Hmm. Is that really what it is, though? I don't know about luck. Maybe. Or maybe it's you. Yes. It almost feels like you have a knack for running into people with the butterflies or something. Yeah, it doesn't sound like a compliment, does it? It's probably because it's not. Sorry, just a thought. I turned to look towards the woman again. She's chatting an animatedly with a co-worker who's a slender, handsome man. Brushing her bangs aside, Hiuchi Danisan stares at the woman with her left eye, cocking her head in puzzlement. Me neither. Or maybe she already solved her own issue before we could intervene? The men had headed heads. Head? Heads into the back of the store, leaving the woman alone. Immediately, we noticed something. I see it. Without delay, a butterfly appears out of thin air, gliding towards the woman. Looks like your suspicions were right. It is her. What do you mean? Does a butterfly disappear? The butterfly is flying away. Hmm. Hmm. The power to repel butterflies instead of attracting them? It's possible, I guess. <laughs> huh? Oh, right. Why don't we go over there? We moved from the center of the walkway to the side. Akizuki-san warned us several times not to draw attention to ourselves. Naturally, it isn't a good idea to just stand there and gawk. We have to be discreet. 
りあえずモヤモヤ消すじゃないや捕まえちゃいます Hmm. Let's try giving out Kizuki san a call first. This could be an unusual case, so we don't want to act rashly. I pull out my phone and call the cafe's number. Let's see what Akizuki san has to say about this. Hi. This is Akamine. Akizuki san listens carefully as I tell her about the woman's situation. It's weird, isn't it? Why is her butterfly appearing and disappearing like that? Yeah, and whenever he leaves, the butterfly comes back. Hiroshirani san thought that maybe the man had some kind of power to repel butterflies. Come again? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Or that maybe when, you know, the demons, or in this case, the butterflies, it was either that or I thought that. Similar to in real life, where you feel like crap if you have these kinds of problems. You feel like crap if you're not doing anything, but when you're distracted by something, those thoughts, those feelings, you just forget about them. You keep yourself busy, is what I'm trying to say. What? She's in love? She has a crush on him? Wait, really? That's why she's attracting butterflies? そんなことってバカにできませんよ。恋というものは恋の持つれが凶悪事件に発展したりもしますからね。恋はよくも悪くも心を書き乱します。その女性も恋のせいで心の安定を欠いてしまっているんでしょう。だから一緒にいれば
That woman only has one or two around her at most, so she isn't terribly affected by them. At least, for now. Even if we do nothing, it's possible that she'll overcome their influence on her own and confess her feelings. But that said, we could still be way off mark. May have nothing to do with love. Her mom got hit by a car. From Mikado's point of view, her personal problems aren't really our concern. The important thing is that we catch the butterfly. Mumbling to herself, Hichidani san sweeps inside her bags. Bangs, not her bags, her bangs, yeah. She stares hard at the woman and the butterfly circling around her. The butterflies begin to emit a pale glow. Shimmering like a mirage, mirage, shrinks down into a tiny particle of light. After that, it sucked right into Hichidani san's insect devouring eye. Wow. That was incredible. Beautiful, even. Smiling shyly, she lets her bangs down, turning to look at the woman again. A moment ago, she had a gloomy expression on her face without the man by her side, but now it's been replaced by a look of determination. An insect devouring eye had captured the lesions of her soul as well. Ichidani san's power affected her for the better. It definitely looks like she has. That's up to her. All we can do is pray that he does. If she gets rejected though. My bad. Anyway, we've done all we can. The rest is out of our hands. Yep, not that I actually did anything. <laughs> you think? It'd feel weird to just go home now. Why don't we grab a drink or something? In that case, how about we get... Oh my gosh. <laughs> Thought you'd say that. We buy two smoothies from the same place we went last time. Last time? Don't remember. Then return to the boutique. We find a nearby bench where we can see the store from and sit down. No problem. It can be a reward for catching a butterfly. Oh, right. Apparently, we received a lot more orders than we expected, so we need all hands on deck. Suzuna-san wants everyone to pitch in and help. Suzuna-san says we'll be back in baking them, baking them, baking them, so they're ready just in time for customers to pick up. So don't worry, there's going to be plenty of work to go around. You'll probably be put on charge of sales. It'll definitely be busy, but at least you will get to spend the holidays together with everyone at the cafe. The man comes out of the boot from the boutique. He appears to be finished with work for the day. Before he can leave, however, the woman calls out to him. I can almost feel my own heart skip a beat just by watching her. Taking a deep breath, the woman seems to make up her mind before saying something to the man. The man looks a little surprised and blushes. Now looking into her eyes, he nods. In that instant, the woman's face bursts into a smile. Oh, okay. As he walks off, she waves goodbye like an excited child. When the man finally is out of sight, she hides her irrepressible smile beneath her hands and returns inside the store. How could one even tell that? I don't understand. And it must have gone well. Too bad the only date we have is our jobs. 
Well, you ready to get going? Hi. We can tell Kizuki-san what happened tomorrow. It's going to be a busy day, so we should get home early and rest up. Did you just want to play with Umikado some more, don't you? It was written all over your face. I think her reaction to Mikado is probably going to be my favorite reaction out of all of them. Uh, I don't mind. Feel free to be yourself. I prefer that actually. What do you mean, too friendly? Sounds like a plan. That's a good spot to end the video. Nah, I'm not, sorry. not just yet. Not quite. Christmas Eve. Although I had to step away for a little while to attend a class, once it was over, I went straight back to helping Suzuna-san, who had been hard at work since morning making cakes. Both Nozomen and Akizuki-san had been helping out in the kitchen as well, while Hiyuchidani-san, Shiki-san, and Mikado are in charge of dealing with the customers. It seems our cakes are selling out almost as soon as they come out of the oven. We must have gotten even more orders than I thought. I'm once again reminded of how just amazing of a baker Suzuna-san is and how popular her sweets are. The afternoon came and went, and the sun began to set. Normally things would finally be settling down, but today, this is when the rush of customers coming home from work start to arrive. In other words, our peak hours are only just beginning. Okay. <laughs> After working all day without a break, the three of us are dead tired. Even Suzuna-san's face is showing signs of fatigue. But we desperately wanted a break though, there was no time for that. Mm-hmm. Oh, sorry. Ah, so it's your fault. But it wasn't an impossible amount. We're nearly there. Putting aside the chit chat, we threw ourselves back into our cake making. After finishing up the last few orders, we finally get a moment to catch our breaths. And with our cakes now completely sold out, we decided to close up shop a little earlier than usual. I never stepped out of the kitchen today, but there must have been a crazy number of customers. もうすごいなんてもんじゃ。3人で対応してましたけど、全然追いつかないくらいでした。クリスマス限定のじゃなくて、いつも販売している景気を買いに来てくれたお客さんも多かったんだけど、そっちもバカ売れでしたね。うん
日も頑張んなきゃそうですね明日に備えて今日はしっかりと休みましょうお疲れ様でしたお疲れ様でした After cleaning up, wiping the place down, and changing clothes, everyone made their way home. Yuchidani san and I, however, stayed behind to tell Akizuki san and Mikaro about what happened at the mall yesterday. So, ka, Buji Cho, Tsukamae, Rukoto, Ga, Dekita, Ka? Ha, hi. Hi. Naze, son, na, chiba, shit, da, me, de, wata, shi, o, mi, o, mi, o, mi, o, mi, ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。And I'm positive that change was due to the influence of Hiyu Chidani san's power. But assuming we were right about her being love struck, she'll most likely become depressed again if she's dumped. So we might have to monitor her situation again if that happens. Mei san no koto wa kizukare te imasen ne? Ah, hai. Chikazuite nai si, kizuite wa inai to omo imasu. Motto mo kizukare te ita tokoro de, Mei no okage de kokoro ga karuku natta to wa omo an daro. 無事、蝶を捕まえることはできた。あとは、放てるようになれば、メイも一人前だな。頑張ります。練習は、私たちがいるときにしてくださいね。一人ではしないように。うっかり蝶を解き放ってしまったら、周囲にどんな影響が出るかわかりませんから。はい。ご苦労だった。今日は、ゆっくり休むといい。お疲れ様でした。At this time, I forget how nice the soundtracks are in this game, too. All these visual novels have such good soundtracks. Oh my god. Love it. I was about to suggest the same thing. You want to go see how that woman's doing, right? Yeah. Hi. Guess she isn't here. Maybe. Probably not here at the mall, though. True. Nothing but Christmas couples, as far as I can see. Hmm? Uchidani san takes a couple of steps away from me. What's wrong? You don't want to be seen with me? <laughs> Ouch. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. You really aren't good with romance and stuff, are you? Okay? <laughs> what? Huh? What do you mean? In what way could you possibly mean? Making it worse. Oh, uh, let me think. No. Oh, no. I've never thought of you as that. Really? If anything, you're the opposite. I've always thought you were very cheery and easy to talk to. What do you mean? I'm listening. Really? Interesting. Oh, 
笑われちゃいました前髪伸ばしてるのもとはなんだろうマジフェイスそう中二病 It sure does give that vibe そういうのだと<笑> Oh, one of those XD kids, the emo kids? Yeah, I see it. So, I thought it was a little bit of 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 a Dang, getting a little too relatable. What's going on? <laughs> What do you mean? If anything, you're always the center of attention. Out of all of us, you're undoubtedly the best at handling customers. Everyone at the cafe relies on you. Speaking of Christmas holidays, can we just acknowledge how nice the Christmas holidays are? Just because of the moods. At least around me, I've noticed everybody is a little more cheerful. If you're Mexican, there's a whole lot of tamales going on. You got the hot chocolate, the grandma hot chocolate. You got a whole lot of great stuff. It's really nice. Love the energy. Love it. She's been staring at the mall's decorative Christmas lights this entire time, but all of a sudden, she turns to face me instead. Then she gives me a deep bow. Springing back up, she grins at me. My puzzled expression. I should be used to seeing her smile by now, but for some reason, the look on her face make, makes my heart skip a beat. I'm、uh, glad I could help you be yourself. Hi. Feeling embarrassed, all I could manage was that bland response, but Hichidani san seemed genuinely happy, smiling even more broadly. Don't sweat it. Got a bit of an unusual situation of my own, actually. I understand how it feels, not being normal. There's a bit of a problem with my soul, you see. And I'm looking for a way to fix it. <laughs> actually, yes. <laughs> well. I hesitate for a moment. I can't exactly tell her. Go out with me and that'll solve everything. If I was the sort of person capable of being so brazen, I wouldn't have done something as outrageous as turn back time's time in the first place. I'm not sure what to do myself, to be honest. I will. Thanks. I will hear you out. Hmm? <laughs> sure. Just that's sort of our tradition now. Every time we come here. <laughs> nah, you don't have to. Nah, -uh. she. <laughs> oh, right.、Uh, I remember that. Seeing your grades go up was reward enough for me. Alright, alright. Together we weave our way through the holiday crowds. Unlike the other couples around me, I wasn't able to find that special someone to spend Christmas Eve with this year. Nevertheless, I had the distinct feeling that I had grown closer to Hiroshi Dain san. You know what's interesting? This might just be the one route where he doesn't end up with someone on Christmas. Oh, didn't that happen with Suzune too? Did they happen before or after or during? I don't remember. But for some reason, I feel or think that this is the route where. He doesn't have someone on Christmas. Interesting. If, so, if I'm wrong, someone please correct me. If I am right, also please tell me. 
thank you. Nevertheless, I had the distinct feeling that I had grown closer to the Hiuchi Dani-san. You know what? This route might actually be short, too. I kind of hope that's not the case. I wouldn't be upset if it was longer than Suzuna's anymore. Especially after I had started playing this, I don't feel that way anymore. But I am very, you know, I was very indeed sad that her route was so short. Wow, what a nice, nice, nice moment they had there. Liking this route even more. It's been a few days since the craziness of Christmas and things had largely returned to normal at the cafe. The end of the year is fast approaching. Today happens to be her last day of work before then. クリスマスの well, scummy rhymes with yummy. Huh? <laughs> Nothing, just forget I said anything. I'm sorry, just ignore me. <laughs> Yo, I forgot about that. Why do you still remember that? Oh, stop, please. I'm sorry. Oh, come on. まあ、高峰君の話はどうでもよくて。すみぞめさん。はい。すみぞめさんのお家って神社よね。はい、そうですよ。参考までに聞きたいんだけど、年末年始に何か特別なことってしてる特別 おみくじは。おみくじは一年中してるよ。でも年始にする人がやっぱり多いかな。おみくじか。うまく取り入れられないかな。The soothing voice. Oh my god. I can't get over it. It's like an orgasm to the ears. いいとかいいかもね。中に入れるのは衛生的に問題があるから注文してお客さんに引いてもらうとか。ああ、いいですね。後で少し相談に乗ってもらってもいいですか。うん、いいよ。仕事熱心なのはいいですが、休む時はし
Though I always feel like I'm imposing since the new year is usually a really busy time for them. So this year, I was just planning to laze around at home by myself. I thought you were going to be celebrating with your relatives. Don't waste your time messaging me. Uh oh, well, maybe you say so. Talk about straightforward. I can feel myself blushing a little. No wonder I'm still rich. <laughs> <laughs> no wonder I'm still mad if I message you first. Don't mention what? Don't mention it. I'll see you next year. Happy holidays. Those I'll see you next year jokes are so stupid. But for some reason, they almost make me crack. Almost. They're so bad that they're good. The more days I have, the faster time seems to go by. Although I hadn't spent the entire time lazing around, the holidays were over in the blink of an eye. Tomorrow it's back to business as usual at the cafe. Oh? I received a message from Hiuchidani san online. Since she'd been messaging me quite frequently over the past few days, I never felt bored, even though I was alone for the holidays. She returned from a trip last night, so I'd assumed her messages would stop coming, but evidently not. Huh. Apparently, she wants to drop by to bring me some osechi. What time can I come over? She asked, to which I reply, I'm free anytime. I should probably clean up a bit before she gets here, but not even a second after the thought crosses my mind. What the? My doorbell rings. She couldn't be here already, could she? Maybe it's as soon as time. Coming. Oh, we're coming. I walk over to the door and open it. <laughs> what? Lo and behold, it's Yuchi Dan-san. Did you get a ride here? I wasn't expecting you so soon. Uh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Start two. Oh, okay. Well, come on in. Sorry about the mess. I didn't have time to clean up. It really was. It really was. Milk yourself at home. I'll get you something to drink. Dang. You came prepared. Oh, thanks. I appreciate it. She shrugs over her jacket before sitting down. I sit down across the table from her. Happy New Year. Yep. That sounds nice. I have no idea what it is, but it sounds yummy. Oh, thanks. Do you mind if I eat some right now? Thanks. There's red tea? Why didn't I know about this? I'll have the uh, green tea. Thanks. You're always so thoughtful, Yuchidani san. <laughs> Why? What do you mean? Oh, okay. Tilting my head, I open the box of Osechi that she hands me. But inside is. What the? There's only kelp rolls in here. おばあちゃんが毎年たくさん作ったからねって持たせてくれるんです。でもたくさんありすぎて消費しきれなくて。というわけでおすそ分けです。すみません、マクロなおせちで。Oh, that's fine. It's the thought that counts. Mind if I go ahead and eat?どうぞどうぞ。私も食べます。あ、中身変化もです。Odd in what sense? That doesn't sound too bad. Let's see. I take an apprehensive bite. I don't know if this is like because it's good or because it's bad. Mm -hmm. 
The moment I bite into it, dashi broth oozes out of the kelp, sending a mild sweetness throughout my mouth. These taste really good, actually. Your grandma must be an amazing cook here, Chinese-san. そうなんですよ。まさにお袋の味って感じで。いや、おばあちゃんですけど。でも色が地味なせいかな。親戚のみんな小分けに手をつけないんですよね。いつも私だけもりもり食べてます。That's probably why she made you so much. 私の胃袋がもっと大きければ全部食べるんですけど。Actually, I'm starving. I can probably finish off the rest myself. Hmm? Oh, nah. I was trying to think of some new dish for our menu. Eager beaver. Hmm, not exactly. It's more like... Remember what I told you on Christmas about my soul? Right. Apparently, I'm unsatisfied with my current life. Honestly, I can't say I've consciously thought that myself, but because my soul isn't satisfied, it's been attracting butterflies. Brushing back her bangs, she gazes at me with her left eye. Thanks to Akizuki-san's inter intervention, my soul is okay for the time being. But also, my soul apparently absorbs these butterflies as well. So even if I were attracting them, you probably wouldn't see them. So in short, that tendency of my soul to absorb butterflies is the problem. Yeah, pretty much. I guess there's no need to tell her about the whole rewinding time thing, or how God might kill me if I leave things the way they are. I don't want to spook her. Anyway, since I need to resolve this problem, I've been giving it a lot of thought. Why exactly is my soul not satisfied? Sort of. You know how our cafe's main pole is Suzune-san's baking, right? Well, I wanted the other items on our menu to be just as popular as your stuff. That's why I tried coming up with some new dishes last time. And after I did, I saw lots of people on Instagram and such saying they thought the food was great. But unsurprisingly, they still felt short of her baked goods in terms of popularity. Oh, don't worry. It's not like I was depressed or anything. I knew I was doing my part to help the cafe. That was enough for me. But that's what my problem was. Thanks, but that's not what I mean. My problem was I was content with the status quo. I've just been, how do I say this? Going with the flow? Telling myself that my cooking was fine, if there was no hurry, that nothing had to change. But over Christmas, it occurred to me. Did customers ever wait in line for my cooking? Did they ever order my cooking in advance? The answer was no. That made me frustrated. Yeah, I'm going to pour everything I have into achieving my goal. That's what I've been lacking up until now. Shikisan motivated me a lot as well. She's constantly thinking about ways to improve the cafe. So over New Year's, I decided to follow in her footsteps and come up with some new ideas of my own. At least, that was the plan. Unfortunately, no. Turns out it's pretty hard to come up with a new dish. Maybe you just need maidens, is what she's gonna tell him. <laughs> what do you mean? No, go ahead. I wanna hear what you have to say. Hmm. 
I see what you're saying. My skills might be improving little by little since I work in the kitchen every day, but still. But since there are no magic tricks, rather than trying to brainstorm the dishes, it'd be more constructive in the long run to work on the dishes already in my repertoire. Is that what you're trying to say? Yes, senpai. That's a Huh? You mean like adding a pinch of love? Their ingredients? Oh. Oh! Oh, みそか、みんなでお寿司食べたんですけど、やっぱり回転寿司とは違いますよね。回転寿司も美味しいんですけど、やっぱりちゃんとしたお寿司屋さんの方が臭みがなかったりして、もちろん職人さんの技もあるん
Sakura smoke chips. If this goes well, I might try out some of the other smoke chips later. Next, I placed a wire mesh over the chips, then the cheese and sausages on top of that. Now to put on the lad lid and set it to high heat until it begins to smoke. You said it. I always thought smoking meat was a lot more difficult. We kept our eyes on the smoker while we chat. Now we switch to low heat. Something's gonna go wrong. <laughs> I feel it. I hope this isn't going to make my room smell. It's pretty strong. Good idea. Just bear with it. Shivering from the cold, she keeps her eyes fixed on the smoker. Alright, let's open her up. She's adorable. Oh. Yep, they're fully smoked through and through. Yeah, apparently that helps the smell mellow out a bit. Not a chance. Let's go ahead and eat. She picks up a piece of cheese, giving it a couple of sniffs. <laughs> Alright, Yuchidan-san. It's the moment of truth. It's gonna be terrible. Oh, really? It's so good. I've never had anything like this before. This is incredible. Let's try the sausage too. So good. Man, the Demon King was right. Smoked foods are something else. That sounds fire. Yeah, I bet it would. <laughs> we are talking about the stuff they sell at the supermarket? That's just plain old ham. Yeah, we use the real stuff, but it definitely doesn't smell anywhere near as good as this. Once we start making our own bacon though, we might just discover a whole new world of flavor. I wonder who's- what? Suzune-san's home. Maybe she'll steal her parents' house. I totally forgot um, Suzune is Hiroto's sister. She pulls out her phone, tapping her furiously. Before long, the doorbell rings. Yuchidane-san goes to answer the door and returns with Suzune-san in tow, who's holding a can of beer. <laughs> Forgot she's an alcoholic. Well, this should be a nice snack for you then. She walks up to the smoker and peers inside. Perhaps because she's slightly drunk, she picks up a piece of cheese without the slightest hesitation and begins to nibble on it. Yep, we were wondering if we could use this to improve the cafe menu somehow. Yep, it's actually easier to make than you'd think. It takes quite a while since you have to let it sit for a week after you salt it, but that's pretty much about it. That's right. About what? 
Uh, yeah. Well, it'll be covered with saw, so. I can't answer her. After all, I've done this before. I have never done this before. Of course, I can't say anything for certain. Now that you mention it, our customers would probably be a little hesitant to eat smoked meat made by an amateur. I get it. I get it. Say less, I understand. Girl, if you don't be quiet, that was a great suggestion. Smoked bacon? Mmm. It's not your fault. Without you, I never would have even thought about using a smoker. It was a great idea to make our own bacon. I'm sure that added smokiness would have taken our carbon out to the next level. Smokiness. As long as there aren't any food safety issues, you said you'd be okay with our idea. Right? There's something I want to try. Could you stay here and wait for a little while? Nah, that's okay. I want this to be a surprise for you too, Yuichi Dani san. Just wait over there with Suzuna san. After ushering them out of the kitchen, I alone remain. Alright, let's do this. うん。ああ、メールなくなっちゃった。お茶飲みますかこれまだ口つけてないですよ。もらおうかな。この昆布巻き美味しいね。おばあちゃんに伝えておきます。いっぱい食べてください。おい、母さんまだ。昆布巻
Ah, stop it. Nei san ga home makutte ru kara, aete no dame dashi ne. Sakki mo itta kedo, balance choosei wa hitsuyo da ne. I know. It's got a pretty strong flavor, so I'm gonna try letting it mellow overnight next time. Shitori de nayamu yori, ashita ni demo minna ni tabete moratta hou ga ii kamo ne. Nde, heikin chi o toru ka, sore tomo aete kuse o gyochou suru ka o kimeru. Ah, naru hodo.思い切り尖らせた方が話題になるかもですね。そうすると好きと嫌いでバッサリ分かれちゃうから判断が難しいけどね。好きにやってみなよ。メニューに追加することは誰も反対しないと思うよ。オーライ、オーケーブルシャン
Y'all stay safe. And until next time.